Their Excellencies, the Right Honourable David Johnston, Governor General of Canada, and Mrs. Sharon Johnston, host the first musical concert at Rideau Hall since his installation as Governor General. Presented in collaboration with the Glenn Gould Foundation, this exclusive concert entitled Young Artists Inspired by Glenn Gould honors the spirit and legacy of the Canadian musical icon. Several dignitaries among them, diplomats, ministers and parliamentarians are on hand for the musical tribute. Glenn Gould is probably the best known Canadian musician internationally um, who's not a pop star. Minister Jason Kenney recognizes Gould's significant contribution to the arts in Canada and globally. He was a, uh, a superstar of his era and he, he represents Canada's uh, brand of musical excellence on the world stage so I think it's a great idea of the Glenn, that the Glenn Gould Foundation has to uh, recognize great emerging uh, musical talents uh, in the name of the Gould tradition. By Brian example, Levine is the executive of director of the Glenn Gould Foundation. He says even though Gould passed away almost 30 years ago, he remains incredibly popular all over the world. Regardless of whether they're from China, from um, Russia, uh, we have one who is uh, coming from Berlin uh, and Venezuela, you know, it's just an enormously long shadow that this fabled Canadian has cast across the musical world and it lasts to this day. Glenn Gould once remarked that the future of music rests with the young. Reading about tonight's performers, I can see why he thought so. The music in the evening's repertoire is music Gould either played, recorded, or arranged from original orchestral scores. 22-year-old virtuoso Georgi Tayedza from Russia was inspired by Gould. His work was like a mortal example of clarity in music. For me. Nine-year-old Canadian musical prodigy William Lathers is excited to share his talent with so many dignitaries. This is my first time being in Ottawa, also performing in Ottawa. Patrons like British High Commissioner Anthony Carey believe the event showcases the influence of Canadian art and creativity on the world stage. Glenn Gould is, is such a remarkable Canadian and, and somebody who is sort of known the world over and known for his slight eccentricity but also his phenomenal virtuosity but also great feeling. I hope that these, uh, that these distinguished lawmakers and, um, and uh, representatives of great nations from around the world will see Canada as a centre of excellence and creativity. Reporting from Rideau Hall in Ottawa, I'm Heather Seaman.